Hey, what is up guys? It's Derek from the Baseball Channel. I'm coming at you again today with yet another video. And today, it's actually going to be relacing my custom A2000. So I got light blue lace from buyfastpitchgloves.com. I really like their lace. They have so many colors, you know, quality lace, and it's really not that expensive. I got five strands. There's an extra strand. Just in case the glove breaks, like the lace snaps or something like that, I can repair it. So the first thing I have to do is uh, unlace the whole glove. And guys, I'm not going to be showing you a how to because I'm not really great at doing it. I use Dirty 30's video. This is, I think, my third glove that I'll be relacing. So, yeah, if you uh, want to know how to do it, check out Dirty 30's channel. I'll uh, drop his the link to his channel in the description of this, this video. And you're also going to need a pair of scissors and a lacing needle, if you can see that. Um, this is my favorite thing to use. There are other tools that you can use to relace your glove, but this is really the easiest. But just to unlace it, it's really pretty self-explanatory. That being said, if you've never relaced a glove before, I recommend you just lace it hole by hole. Uh, it'll take you a while, but don't unlace everything at once. Just unlace one hole, put the new lace in. Unlace the next hole, put the new lace in. Alright guys, so here's the aftermath. Here's the web. Here's the glove, obviously it's all deconstructed, you can see inside, um, open it up, whatever. So yeah, this is it, here's all the lace that came out of it. This is pretty much just trash, um, it's also wrinkly, and it was never really great lace to begin with, so um, I'm just going to throw that away. I don't really have any use for it, but now one thing I like to do, uh, since all the lace is out, I like to oil the glove, or condition the glove, uh, so here's some Nakona, uh, just because now without the lace you can get in the nooks and crannies that you couldn't get before. So places that have never seen a uh, conditioner are going to be able to get it now. So I'm not going to use a ton, just enough to get the job done. Alright guys, so I'm going to finish this up and then uh, come back to you. Alright guys, so now once that oil is on, I recommend taking a rag, just wiping it down. This is going to get off all the excess oil and it should rub off some dirt. So this way it's rubbed off the down by the oil. Alrighty, so now that's all dirty. Also condition the web if you didn't already. Alright, so now guys, I'm just going to start relacing this guy. Uh, yeah, this should be fun. It'll probably take me a little while. I actually have a game tonight, and uh, this is my gamer. That's probably not the best time management, but the lace came in. I don't have an off day till next week. Um, I play today through Monday, so, and today is a uh, Friday. So if I don't post this video in time today, just a uh, reference point. So now this thing is super loose because there's no lace to hold it. I'm really hoping the lace doesn't stiffen it up too much, but you know what? What are you going to do, right? So I'm going to go ahead and start. All right, see you guys. All right, guys, so I'm actually all done. Here is the glove, released entirely in Columbia blue. Uh, it turned out really, really good. I really like the way it looks. It's not too stiff. I think it looks really good on the on the blonde, just on the palm. If you can see it there. And then the back too. I love the way it looks with the black. I really just love the way it turned out. Honestly, this is something I've wanted to do since the day I got this glove. I was really mad because Wilson doesn't offer Columbia Blue lace on their site. But the navy worked and it did, it jo did its job. But as the glove is wearing out a little bit, I figured it was time for a change. Uh, bring some life back into this guy and get me through another season or two with it. I love the way it turned out. I think it looks so much better. Uh, I wish this is the color it was before. Most of the blue on this glove is faded anyway, so to have a flash of blue black back really makes me happy. I love the way it turned out. I have a game today that I'll be using it in, and it's not too stiff. It's a little stiffer, so I think I'm actually going to maybe throw in some shots at the end of this. Uh, play some music just to show you guys how it looks uh, better than just my room maybe I'll go outside and get some natural light 
Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and play ball. This is the Baseball Channel.